welcome along to Arsenal Fan TV and uh, just taking a look through the, the newspapers today and also taking a look through the internet and I came across uh, this very disturbing uh, transfer rumour that's going around today from the Daily Mirror. Don't know if you can see it there. Bayern Munich want Alexis Sanchez as Germans plot summer transfer soup for Arsenal star. The Germans have made a discreet inquiry, it says, about whether Arsenal would be prepared to sell Sanchez this summer. Um, listen, could be a load of rubbish. You know what time of year it is. You're going to get loads of these type of stories because we're moving into um, transfer season. Season's coming to an end. Lots of rumours start flying around. But I started to look at this story and started to think and started to say to myself, you know what, actually, these rumours are a bit worrying for me because Alexis Sanchez, world-class player, had a fantastic first season at Arsenal. This season hasn't been as good, but there has been kind of mitigating circumstances. He had injuries. Um, he came out from the, the Copa America really, really tired. Um, also played out of position playing him out on that left-hand side all the time, cutting in, again, didn't help him. Recently, as he's been put back over to the right, he's got his uh, fitness back. We started to see the old Alexis again. Very important player for our team. In the future, if we're going to win anything, we need guys like him, we need guys like Ozil to be in our team. He's got two years left on his contract that he's got with us. Two years is a dangerous time because players like him are thinking, well... Do I sign an extension? You know, do I look to move on? You know, I, I think Alexis Sanchez, he looks like a guy that's very happy at Arsenal. Um, also, there's rumours that Mesut Ozil will sign his new contract. Um, but listen, it is still worrying times because Bayern Munich are a big club. Let's face it, we love this club, Arsenal. Massive club. We were being told when we moved into the new stadium that we aspire to be the new sort of Bayern Munich, but let's face it, at the moment, we're a million miles away from Bayern Munich, and if Alexis Sanchez is being offered the real deal, it's got to be tempting. His mate, Arturo Vidal, his teammate from Chile, also plays for them, and has had a great season, so settling in wouldn't be a problem. He's going to be playing with world-class players in Lewandowski, in Thomas Muller, in Iron Robin, you know, uh, just player after player of world-class ability, Douglas Costa. They're going to be winning things. They're going to win the league again, Bayern Munich, probably win it next year in their league. They're in the semi-finals yet again of the Champions League. They're a winning team. They're a top, top team. Alexis Sanchez is 27 years of age. He might be thinking to himself, well, you know what? This could be a big move for me. Arsenal really need to get our act together. If we're going to keep these world-class players like Ozil, like Alexis Sanchez, I think, first of all, the club needs to give them assurances. Are the club able to give them those assurances? I think the sort of assurances these guys are looking for is not just money. It's not just about money for guys like Alexis and Mesut Ozil. They've got loads of money. They've got loads of... Uh, deals apart from, you know, even just the wages they earn at Arsenal. It's not just about money for them. It's about winning. You can see Alexis Sanchez is a winner. They're going to want assurances to know that, number one, the manager, what's happening with him? Will he be here next season? Is he going to be here the season after? What's happening with him? That's number one. They're also going to probably want to know what sort of players are coming in. They're not stupid. They'd be like us and they'd be like thinking to themselves, we didn't buy the right players and Alexis Sanchez will be thinking, all due respect, but, you know, Mikel Arteta and Matthew Flamini and guys like this are not in my league. What are we bringing in when these guys go in the summer? Who? What sort of players is Arsene Wenger looking to bring in? Is he going to be bringing in young prospects or is he going to be bringing in world-class players? Is a, Will I be playing next to a Higuain next season? You know? Or is it going to be Giroud? These are the sort of things that these guys like Alexis Sanchez and Mesut Ozil are going to want to know before they put pen to paper. And it's worrying times because if we don't make these 
big steps in the summer with transfers, if we're not decisive in what we do with the management situation, and as I said, these players are not stupid. They would have seen all the banners. They would have read all the, you know, stories of discontent. They might even have watched a couple of Arsenal fan TV videos of fans. They might have gone onto websites like Ask Blog and, you know, all these other great Arsenal websites where fans and bloggers are writing things that they're not happy. They're not stupid. They would have done that. Even when they post a picture on their Instagram account or whatever, they'll see some of the negativity that comes back from fans. And they want to turn it around. And they'll also be acutely aware of what's going to be happening next season with the amount of money that's going to be coming into clubs with all these new managers, Pep Guardiola, Mourinho, Conte. You know, they're going to be aware of these things and they're going to be like, you know what, what do I do? Do I stay here at Arsenal? Or do I go to somewhere where I think I've got a major chance of winning things and there has to be a change I, I kind of did a video on this yesterday a vlogging video from outside the emirates where i said there's got to be mega changes in the summer in attitude everything to do with arsenal mentality and these guys are winners and Alexis sanchez is a winner and he's going to want to see that so let's hope he signs the new contract let's hope that these rumors are just you know your usual rumors that float around at this time of year but certainly i feel it is slightly worrying times when it comes to players like Alexis Sanchez and Mesut Ozil. Do Arsenal have the ambition next season to go out and show these guys that, yes, this will be a winning team next season? You can find out in the summer. Leave your comments below. You know what I'd love you to do? Leave a comment on two players that you feel are the type of players that would strengthen our team and give us a chance of winning the league next season. And also the type of players that would make these guys encourage and think, yeah, oh, definitely signing. Exciting times ahead. Because I think that's what they're going to be looking for. So leave that. Don't forget to subscribe here to Arsenal Fan TV. And also don't forget to get over and subscribe to my brand new channel called Man Like Robbie. The links are below. Um, that's a channel where we talk about all football. It's really, really going well. 10,000 subscribers in one week. I'm really, really grateful for that. Thank you very much to everybody who watches Arsenal Fan TV who's gone over there and subscribed. And to everybody else who subscribed as well, thank you very much for that. Keep subscribing to that. That is going to be... We're going to be doing so many mega things on there. And of course, here on Arsenal Fan TV, we're about to get going soon with... <laughs> and I can see some fans going, Oh, no! <laughs> Transfer daily. He coming back for the summer, right? Listen, we gotta go through the transfer rumors, right? So uh it's coming back. We've got a, like a new fallback to that as well. <laughs> no, I'm not I'm laughing, right? Because I can just see some people watching this now going, oh no, the whole summer again. <laughs> rumor after rumor after rumor, and then Wenger turns around and just signs. Some kid from the second division in France. He cannot do that this summer. I swear, if he does that this summer and he's still at Arsenal, I, 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 I don't even want to think about what it will be like the first couple of games of the season um, next year. So <laughs> let, let's see what happens. Don't forget to subscribe as well here to Arsenal Fan TV. And thanks for watching this video. I look at the work rate of some of the players. Alexis Sanchez puts five, six, seven in to shame. And every week, it's the, the, the same players turning out and turning out again. The manager is not managing this football club. And that is a fact. He's not managing the football club, Robbie. And, you know, the fans are, are upset. The fans are now getting 